Hi, this is to show you how to check if a unit that you're looking at is affordable. Um, so let's say you uh, go to file.ai and you wanna look for a unit here. Um, so if you're looking at this unit, for example, uh, you see that it's a four bedroom and it's 2095. Um, so you could enter the address that you take from here. So I'm just gonna copy this address. Um, and then in your page, click on uh, Referrals and Vouchers. Under the Action, go to Renter Profile. In Renter Profile, you can scroll down to the Affordability Calculator. Now, I'm just going to paste the address that I had on there. And this is suggesting that the um, address is in Heath. So, this is for the deductions. You should have this information on your voucher already, um, but generally if you are a person who may be elderly or have a disability, that deduction is 400. Um, if you have children uh, under the age of 18, uh, that deduction would be 480. Um, so you can multiply that by each child. Um, and then the gross annual income, let's say it's 12,000. Again, this should be on your voucher as well. Uh, estimated utilities for the unit. Usually if um, it's a single family home, um, you'll pay for all of the utilities in, in the unit. Um, if the refrigerator is provided by the owner um, and the, the, the stove or the microwave, also known as the range of the microwave, is, is provided by the owner, um, you could click on these two and click calculate and save. If it's an apartment um, or a townhouse, sometimes the water and sewer and trash are already paid. So those are um, pretty generalized assumptions there. Um, so the estimated utilities here is 346. Um, and so for this unit, the rent is 2095. And the unit is a four bedroom. And my voucher size is also a four bedroom. So I can click on check affordability. And here it says success. This unit is affordable. Um, and this will tell me um, what the HAP to owner is. So it looks like the full HAP would be paid by uh, the housing authority in this example. Um, and you could check uh, utility allowance details here. Thanks. And let's say I found a different unit um, on Bob.ai that I wanted to take a look at. So this one is 3,200, similar, but it's a five bedroom. You could still go here, 1010 10, Fredonia, so 1010 10, Fredonia, same deductions. Now I'm going to select that it's a five bedroom. Calculate and save that. See how the utilities go up. And then I check this again, 3,200. And now the bedroom size is a five bedroom and I have a four bedroom. So let me check the affordability there. And this tells me no, the unit is not affordable. So that's how you could check your affordability. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to post it on community and we'll take a look. Thank you.